All right, guys, we're getting ready to do, this is Taco Tuesday, which we're not gonna do tacos. We're gonna do a little Mexican dish here. Uh, I just got the uh, converted charcoal grill cranked up here. See the charcoal in there. Uh, we're getting ready to do some uh, Mexican pasta. All right, let's get started. All right, we've got the uh, two pounds of regular hamburger meat and got like a pound of deer meat. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this deer meat, or meat rather, and we're gonna bring it over here and we're gonna put it on the uh, the grill, but it's too hot right now. So we're gonna let these coals ch uh, cool down. And uh, and then we're gonna, we dice some uh, onions up here, one onion, one sweet yellow onion we diced it up and we're going to put that in the meat as it gets going here's our uh here's what we're going to do uh the ingredients we got taco seasoning black pepper regular salt i know it says but right there's salt in there some garlic powder some corn i'm going to mix it up a little bit put some black beans in there some rotel tomatoes with uh the green chilies, one can of mushroom pasta sauce, and then these are the uh, medium shells, pasta shells. And we're not gonna use any measuring cups, we're gonna use four bottles of water to pour in here, but anyway. All right, y'all, let's, uh, let's wait on this fire to uh, get down a little bit. Them coals are still really hot. Uh, we'll let it cool down just a little bit, and then we'll get this on there. It, and it's, you know, we ain't gonna have to have that much heat. But I'm using one of these large cast iron pans that was donated to me from my mom. Thank you, mom. And we're gonna try it for the first time tonight. Being it's a Taco Tuesday, we're gonna do something Mexican. All right, y'all stay tuned. All right, y'all, them coals are still red. It's pretty hot, but I think we can go ahead and start browning the hamburger. Got one of these bigger pans here. I may have to adjust and move it around and everything else a little bit. taco seasoning, just regular taco seasoning, because I'm doing a bigger batch than uh, I normally do. Well, not really. I
All right, guys, I'm gonna leave these running just a little bit. Got a can of Rotel tomatoes. Throw those in there. Those are with the uh, green chilies, okay? Got some black beans, y'all. I'm gonna add into that. I drain those. And then we're gonna add one can of <laughs> pasta sauce. That was the mushroom type. Okay. Now what we're going to do before I do anything, I got to go get my gloves. Be back in a second, y'all guys. I got that sauce stirred in there. If you're working on a cook stove, it's you know it's a whole lot easier than out here with this big old skillet on this charcoal and having to deal with heat. You can just turn it turn it down. But I'm doing this because I'm trying to get prepared for anything that hits us. If I've got to cook off charcoal or wood or whatever, I'm going to be able to do it. So that's one of the reasons why I like cooking off this charcoal grill. All right, we're going to let this simmer for just a little bit. Probably five, six minutes maybe. Depends on how hot that gets. And then we'll get ready to add the more, uh, add, actually, I'm going to let it simmer for about two minutes, and then I'm going to throw the cheese on it, part of the cheese. All right, be back in a second. All right, guys, I missed a step here. I'm sorry. This is where, actually, right now is when you put your second seasoning, when you're using three pounds anyway, the way I'm doing it, our second uh, pack of seasoning. Sorry, y'all, I'm all over the board. We had a dog escape a while ago. We had to go run and go get it. Uh, now, the second pack of seasonings in there. Now we're going to stir it up real good. Let it cook in there. In about three or four minutes, that's when we're going to add the first, the first cheese layer. Okay? Man, it smells great. few minutes here and throw the cheese to it all right y'all I've got 12 ounces of sharp cheddar cheese now this is when it's time to add the cheese and what I'm going to try to do about to get the good part out. Yeah. Alright, we're going to do cheese on here. Okay. 
A lot of this recipe, y'all can do pretty much what you want. I mean, you can make it like I'm making it. There's, I'm just going to use the whole bag up. There's people that use, probably put Dorito or Fritos, Doritos, whatever in there. All right, we're going to let that cook and melt for just a few minutes here, and then we'll get right back on it. All right, y'all, I'm going to stir this cheese up. It's doing real well. Melting in there really nice. Okay. I think I can just eat this like it is, man. Give me some, some of them tortilla chips. All right, but we're not there. All right, next thing we're going to do is going to add some water to it, y'all. They say around three cups or whatever, but I've got 16 ounces. So that would be one quart, two quart. But I didn't want to put exactly what they said in here because of my pan. I've got to, I've got to leave room. I don't want to go over my pan, so I'm, I'm doing it kind of by... the height of the pan and it's a pretty deep it's a pretty deep pan looks like three water bottles is going to be the magic number if not we got a fourth one all right y'all got this is 16 ounces of noodles here the shell noodles, the medium, not the little ones. I think that's going to be just right. Sprinkle that. This is the four Mexican style four cheese. There you go. Now, what we're going to do is spread it out here best we can. Because this bad boy is done. All right. There you go, y'all. Mexican pasta. And it was, I admit, it was a little bit tough on the uh, on the charcoal smoker. I mean, the charcoal grill. I mean, not really that tough, but it, it was a little bit different. Um, you had to move things around and and everything but uh we're gonna uh give it just a few minutes let this uh cheese melt um which is like take it off now and then uh we'll taste test it all right stay tuned see what this <clears throat> concoction looks like Here we go. Looks like Brandon's already in it when he's stirring it. He's stirring it. All right. That's what it looks like. Looks pretty good. Thicken up just good, didn't it? Oh, yeah. Blow a little piece off, Brandon, and take a bite. Mm -mm. No? Alright. Well, listen, y'all. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. Mexican pasta. See you on the next video.